Hey guys, this is MacHeads101, and as many of you know, if you go into Time Machine and you don't have an external hard drive, it's just going to say Set Up Time Machine, and if you don't have an external hard drive, it might be very annoying and you want to back up your computer. So I know a very simple way to get around this, which is actually backing up your computer on your hard drive. So the first thing you need to do is make your computer, um, f first check if there's some free space. You can do that by clicking on Macintosh HD and pressing Apple I. You'll get a little window here and you can just look at that. You want to see under available, right now I have a 200 gig hard drive, well it's actually 185.99 gigabytes. And I used around uh, 30, around 40 gigabytes. So I have like 150 gigabytes available. So I have enough to um, make a backup drive. So to make a backup drive, which is going to be a separate hard drive, um, to do this, which means your computer thinks it has two hard drives, but actually it has one. Uh, what you do is you're going to open up Boot Camp. You can just find it using Spotlight. And Boot Camp is made so that way you can install Windows on your computer to have a separate, uh, have a separate hard drive for Windows. So you can part your disk, just um, install how much you want for your um, backup and how much you want for um, Mac OS X. I know that it has a Windows sign, but we're going to take care of that later. So for now, I'm going to make it um, a 50 gigabyte drive. So I'm just going to drag that to 50 um, gigabytes or you can divide it equally you can do whatever you want what whenever you, once you're done picking whatever you want you click partition right there now this takes um, a, a couple of minutes so I'm just gonna do a cut here as it finishes okay now that it is done bootcamp is going to ask me to install um, a Windows disk so that I can install Windows by the way you can't do this process if you already have Windows installed so um I'm going to quit and install later because we just wanted to part our hard drive. We didn't actually want to install Windows. So right now, if you want, you can rename this from Boot Camp to Backup Drive so you don't get com confused. I'll, I'll call that Backup. Okay, so now I can just open up Time Machine and I, I can click Set Up Time Machine, which will open my system preferences. First off, I want Time Machine to be checked on and also it doesn't know what disk it wants to save everything to. So I'm going to change the disk and I'm going to choose the backup disk. Okay, so I'm going to have to use from backup. But right now my backup disk is ready to, to, to have Windows installed on it. So it's going to have to change it from a Windows disk to um, a backup disk. So you're going to have to say use selected volume and then say erase, which is going to erase um, the file to make it a Windows disk so that way it can be um, back up this. So this takes a little time so I'm just going to do another cut here as it finishes. Okay. So now that it is done, it is um I have Time Machine all set up and it says it'll do my next backup in 108 seconds. Or I can go if I have Time Machine showed in the menu bar, you can know if you have it cuz it'll this little checkbox will be checked. I can just go to Time Machine and say backup now. Now it takes a little while to back up because I, th I already have 50 gigabytes um, on my computer. So um, 50 gigabytes of content to back up. So I'm just going to do a cut here as it finishes backing up. Okay, well right now I actually canceled the backup because it took too long and I, I have to do stuff afterwards. But um, you probably know how to use Time Machine. I, I already have it set up. Like, uh, if you did all this, you have it set up, you just haven't had it backed up. So, the the farthest you can go is now, back in time, so all of these windows have nothing in them. But, right now, you have Time Machine set up, and you can back up whenever you choose to back up. And then you can go back into um, your regular computer. Now, let's say you choose you don't want to back up your computer anymore, and you don't want to, or like you buy an external hard drive, and you don't want to back up on your hard drive. So you can turn off Time Machine, and to do this, um, to make to get rid of this, and to just yeah get rid of it. First off, you're gonna have to make it a Windows format disk again. So you can do that by opening up Disk Utility. You can find it in Spotlight. Now, once you have Disk Utility open, you're going to want to click on the drive that you wanna um change. And you're going to want to click up here where it says erase. Just click on that. And we're going to erase all the content on that, like things that we might have backed up and also like that. But right now it is a Mac OS X disk. 
remember, and we wanted it to be an MS DOS disk, which is what um, Windows runs. So just go uh, down there where it says MS DOS, and you can call it whatever you want. You can just call it MS DOS. And then once you're done and you did all that, just click erase. It'll ask you if you want to erase to make sure. Say yes or erase. It's going to prepare to erase. The disk is going to disappear again for a second because it's um, changing it and it leaves while it changed. And so now it's we're like when we were at, at the beginning of the video when we wanted to um, start. So we can just open up Spotlight. It'll take a little while, but there we go. And now we open up Boot Camp again. Okay, so now we say continue. And we want to create or remove a Windows partition. In this case, we're going to remove. So we say continue. So we're going to make it so that way we have 100% on Mac OS X. Because that's what I'm showing you how to do. So I click restore. It's going to ask you for your password, your administrator password. I'm just going to type that in. And there we go. Just hold on one second. Then you can quit boot camp. You'll be all set like you were at the beginning of this video. So, um, yeah, thank you for watching, and have a nice day. Goodbye.